Let us evaluate the integral cos x minus sin x divided by square root of sin 2x. In this kind of integral, what we generally observe is that if we differentiate some term on the denominator, we get numerator. But we don't have anything such type here, apparently so. But maybe we can express denominator in such a way that if we differentiate the numerator, or sorry, if we differentiate the denominator, we'll get denom numerator. So numerator we copy as it is. Denominator we have sine 2x. That can be written as 2 sin x into cos x. Observe that this is 2ab. And we know that 2ab equal to a plus b whole thing square minus a square minus b square. So let's do this here. Once again we copy the numerator as it is cos x minus sin x. Denominator we write it as a plus b whole thing square minus a square b square. So sin x plus cos x whole thing square minus sin square x minus cos square x but sin square x plus cos square x is 1 so this is just 1 ah now you you obtain sin x plus cos x and if you differentiate derivative of sin is cos derivative cos is minus sin so you exactly get the numerator so so we substitute or we let sin x minus cos sorry sin x plus cos x equal to u let us take let u equal to sin x plus cos x then du dx let's differentiate it both side this imply if you differentiate it both side so du dx equal to d dx of sin x plus cos x and derivative of sin x is cos x and derivative of cos x is minus sin x you get the exact expression on the numerator so we can write this method is called method by substitution so we will substitute cos x minus sin x into dx simply as du a much simpler expression so let i equal to this integral that imply i equal to integral cos x minus sin x dx is just du just du root over as it is sin x plus cos x is u so we get u square minus 1 now this is a standard integral integral of 1 by x square minus a square sorry integral 1 by root over x square minus a square dx equal to log of x plus root over a square x square minus a square plus some constant of integration of course uh, Initially, we did not have anything like u. We had sin x plus cos x. So, let's replace u by sin x plus cos x and we are done. Lastly, we replace u by sin x plus cos x. We replace u by sin x plus cos x. So, u square minus 1 will be simply 2 sin x into cos x. plus some constant of integration. Of course, this can be further written as two sin x cos x is sine two x.